Hello everybody, thank you for being here. Today I'm going to talk about a user modeling framework for context aware recommender systems. My name is Sergio Sunza. I'm from the Autonomous University of Baja California in Tijuana, Mexico. The agenda for today is introduction and some definitions, the problem statement, some related work, the proposed solution, then finally conclusions and future work. Let's get started. Recommender systems are software systems that try to predict the use actions the user wants to perform, items to consume, products to buy, and so on and so on. This with the intention to facilitate the decision-making process of the user. A current research trend in recommender systems is the inclusion of context information into the recommendation process. These new type of recommender systems are known as context-aware recommender systems or CARs. Contextual information plays an important role in the recommendations as the user behaviors are affected by the current situation like the time, the locations, the mood, or the weather. Whatever the specific technology or algorithm used by the recommender systems, it can provide high quality recommendations after having modeling the use the user preference. Therefore, in CARS, a user model is an essential component used to store the information that later will be used by the algorithms. A user model is defined as the acknowledge about the user, either explicitly or implicitly encoded which is used by the system to improve the interaction. We have mentioned context. Context is defined as any information that can be used to characterize the situation of an entity. An entity is a person, place, object that is considered relevant to the interaction between the user and the application, including the user and the application themselves. A current issue in the CARS area is the lack of tools to support and facilitate the development of the recommender system from a software engineering point of view, especially tools for user and context modeling, which lead developers and research the work of designing their own models based on the based on their knowledge and with no, no model to use as a reference. So our proposal solution is a user modeling framework for context-aware recommender system called UMERS. The goal of the framework are to serve as a tools that developers and research can use to increase the productivity while building the data model for a context-aware recommender system and to serve as a reference model for further research in user modeling and context-aware areas as the proposal includes a general user modeling a general user model for recommender systems that organize a large set of user context and items information some related work as context is not a new research topic there exist model and tools for context modeling but these these models focus only on the context information, leaving aside or important information needed by context of recommender systems like the user or the information about the items. There also, also exist a very few tools specifically designed for context of recommender systems. For example, Hybrid is a development framework that focuses mainly on the implementation of different recommendation algorithms. These tools contain a lot of recommendation algorithms ready to be used, but the, the proposal used a very restricted key value per to model the information, and such approach may, makes very difficult to express a complex data model as no relations between the data are supported. Another Another tool is presented in this reference is an online tool designed to facilitate the creation of the data models for context-aware recommender systems. 
These tools intend to, intend to help developers in the designing of their own data models. In this tool, developers can describe the list of aspects they want to include into the future model design. So the tool can, use, can be used mostly to create this list of aspects, but, the, but these tools do not use any standardized notation to help developers take this list closer to a design or implementation. The first part of our proposal is a general user modeling, a general user model for recommender systems. The model is a set of attributes used to store most of the information that a context aware recommender system needs. Such attributes were gathered through a systematic literature review based on kitchen hand methodology to organize all the information we found in this literature review. We use the following categories user, context, items, and activity information. Each one described briefly next. User aspects try to describe the user as a person considering the information that will be of interest for the recommendation algorithms or by the system itself. Of the user, we found information related to contact, demographic information, physiological information, interest and preference, the role, personality, emotion, and mental information. The next category is context. Context aspects describe the situation or environment of the user in a given moment. The content information is subdivided into computing, location, time, physical condition, results, and social information. Next category is items. For the items information, the models include the information about the elements we found in the literature review that are being recommended by context aware recommender systems, for example, audio, video, and hotels. Finally, the last category is activity. An activity represents what the user is doing in what context, in what context using a specific items and can store the rating value that the user gives to the item. For example, a user John is running in the park, the context, while listening the activity to a specific song, the item. So, once the data model is defined, such model is implemented into a development framework called UMERS. The goal of the framework is to facilitate the creation of CARS systems providing a ready-to-use data model that saves developers the time they will need to spend designing their own model. The proposal is open source and implemented in c and .NET framework. Here we can have a general view of the architecture. The conceptual layer corresponds to the model described before and the technical layer we have classes. Classes are the implementation of the model using object orientation so developers can create instance of the classes, assign data to the attributes and call the class methods to persist the data. And as for the data managers are add-ons that will work over the data. For, for example, we have an ORM add-on to persist the information from the classes to the database and from the database to the classes. We also have a dataset generator that read, reads the data from the database and format it using CSV or binarized format so this data can be fed directly into recommendation algorithms. All the classes we have in the model have this CRUDS operation for create, read, update, and delete. And here is an example of how such methods can be used. The first part show how to create an instance of a user class, assign, attributes, assign data to the attributes, and save the, the data to the database. 
The second part shows how to obtain a list of users based on a given last name and finally how to remove a record. Here is an example of how class is configured for the dataset generator. Once the class is configured for the dataset, here is how to, how to create a dataset from the data existed in the database. First, we select what data from we want to include in such dataset, and then we specify the format and the destination of the data. We test our proposal using real-world dataset to see if the, the framework supports all the information exists into these datasets. The results shows that the model supports most of the information except for the physical yield of a user, the decisions, the time zone, and for this large dataset, 150 attributes were not, not supported basically because they were given as an incognite so we can map to any aspect of, of the model. So in conclusions and future work, this works introduce UMAS framework, an open source user modeling framework for context aware recommender systems. The contribution is this is the first model designed to model the user and context information for context aware recommender systems that is ready to work. And is it have an easy to use object oriented class architecture to manage the data from the context aware recommender systems. Current work is being done on evaluating the usability of the framework as how this usability is perceived by developers while using the framework to implement some real work tasks. Future work can be done on implementing the proposal in different languages and platforms and also future work can include uh, can be done on including a future selection model so this this model select this future selection module selects only the relevant information from the database and use only use this relevant information to create a better data set so when we feed the data from from the model to the algorithms all the, the only the relevant information goes into this data set here the reference of our work and finally thank you very much for your attention my name is Regin Sunza if you have any question please don't hesitate to write me at this email Thank you.